A very good morning and Om Shanti to all of you listeners. Welcome back to your channel. See the solar truth lies within. And today we are doing a recording, even though it is quite foggy over here in the Shobri Nightingale Park, but still you can see my face and you can hear my voice. That's more than enough. We are still waiting for the clear days, the sunny days, so that I can show you the beautiful Kanchenjunga range. Till then, just hold on, hang on onto this channel, and uh, let's go ahead with today's godly versions of blessings. God says that. May you donate virtues or may you donate powers to other souls and sometimes may you donate knowledge. It is said that if you do any kind of donation that it multiplies and comes back to you many fold. So here we are talking about letting people see how virtues can be used in this life, even in this Kalyu, even this Yuga which is known as hell on earth. How you can use virtues and how you can use powers so as to bring any situation in control not a person in control but any situation in control and make your mind peaceful and powerful and go ahead and solve the situations and be successful so godfather here says in this blessing may you be a cooperative and elevated donor cooperate with whom with godfather and an elevated donor who makes weak ones who are weaker souls weak ones powerful with your powers and virtues what does that mean let's see that all the virtues and powers of the worthy children who have an elevated stage constantly cooperate at the time of need. Let's say we are spiritual, we are constantly in touch with Supreme Godfather and we are using our virtues, we are using our powers. We are not getting distracted by worldly things, we are not getting attracted by worldly things. So we are in constant connection with the Supreme Being, with the Supreme Father. What do we do then? At that time, if you see any soul who is feeling powerless, who is feeling virtueless, who is stuck in their life, we can use that stability of mind which we have attained through meditation and help that soul see the light at the end of the tunnel. Help that soul find the right path, the right way of thinking and bring that soul out of misery. So God says, the special form of service that they do is to donate the virtues. Okay, at this time you need patience, at this time you need to think in a loyal and a royal way. You need to be patient and you need to have humility at this time. You need to accept people as they are. Because some people, they can't accept people as they are and they get into rage, they get into depression, they get into fear, they get into anger and their state of mind falls further down. So God wants us to help those souls out by donating virtues. Then God says, they also give... <coughs> They receive from the Father to the, the powers and the virtues they receive from the Father, they give it to the souls who do not have this knowledge. So first is taking knowledge, but some souls don't even have the power to take this knowledge. So what do they do? Then you donate them virtues, you donate them those powers so that they can stabilize their mind and they can improve their life and then they can adopt this knowledge which is a very deep knowledge. So God says they also give the cooperation to Brahmin souls, who are Brahmin souls who are following the footsteps of Adam or Brahma, who are following this knowledge completely. So give cooperation to those souls. Don't give them knowledge because they've already taken knowledge. Don't tell them what to do, what not to do, but guide them. Then God says to make weak ones powerful is an elevated donation and form of cooperation. You make the weak ones powerful. Just as you do service through your words and mind, this is service through our words and when we meditate we are doing service through our mind, in the same way, give the cooperation of the virtues and powers you have received to all souls, not just one soul. This, this is why we think about everybody as a soul, irrespective of which religion, which caste, which creed they think they belong to. but we let them feel that they are souls, they are equal to everybody around and we can then give godly virtues to them. <coughs> because virtues don't have a religion, powers of the soul don't have a religion and godly knowledge doesn't have any limitation of any religion. So then God says, in the same way give the cooperation of the virtues and powers you have received to all the souls, received from whom? This knowledge from Supreme Godfather what virtues, what values to use at what time and when you receive that, when you find peace in your own life then you go out and help other people that see I use this knowledge, I use this virtue, I use this power at this particular time in this kind of situation, you too can use it and God says and enable them to attain something 
so god is an ocean of virtue god is an ocean of powers mental powers mental virtues and that's what god wants us to donate what are those powers what are those virtues even you can come and learn it at brahma kumari's college spiritual university which is a spiritual academy or a spiritual college a spiritual university for everybody it's a universal that means for any soul irrespective of which religion they think they belong to they can come and learn over here with this have a blessed day om shanti